What up, YouTube? Uh, just giving you a little short update. Um, uh, added my bottom row for my LED lights. Um, 20 foot long, all, all one solid piece. I had that in the design for my entertainment center. Uh, if I made the top come out a little bit more and then when I added the trim, I could either just put it right up underneath there. Uh, we'll add the shelves too as well. Um, and basically that's how I designed the shelves with the trim. Um, it's basically, basically that's the front of the shelves. I did make extra shelves just in case of anything. And added that extra lip because the trim in the front is actually inch and a half. Some people will put like a scribe just to cover, just to ply with itself. But I made like that, that way, and this is just an example, that way I could just mount the LED right underneath there. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to run some, cut each piece and then run some separate wires. That way, that way for the styles, it would, um, it's actually going to hide because all of it just goes all straight in. So I run separate wires. <clears throat> In the styles, and then only the LEDs will be on the shelf itself, and that will have a different remote for it. So that's a whole nother project. But um, other than that, that's just a short little upgrade, I guess. And running those wires is gonna be a healthy task, and make it look clean, flush, and everything else. So. <clears throat> Thank you. Appreciate you watching. And um, actually, these remotes, these LEDs I bought is actually a, uh, for an RF signal. So the remote you could point. These remotes you could point anywhere. It doesn't matter. You have to point it directly, directly to it, and it'll just uh, turn off. I could point it at the window, and it'll turn off. So definitely get an RF remote versus those IR. A lot better. And actually, the remote is actually in the cabinet uh, behind um, one of the subwoofers. Not behind the subwoofer, but in the cabinet with the subwoofer. So the doors are blocked and everything. It's actually on the right-hand side, and it, um, and it and it works fine. So, well, definitely appreciate it. Uh, hope everybody have a great weekend. And uh, have a happy Father's Day weekend, too, as well. Thank you. Bye.